The Youth Action Movement is an arm of Reproductive Health Uganda responsible for promoting effective, meaningful involvement and participation of young people in leadership and youth programs implementation for a quality young population. Uh, my name is Katai uh, Ambros and I have been the president or the chairperson of the Youth Action Movement since 2016 to date when I'm supposed to be transitioning power to another leadership. So Youth Action Movement is a, a concept by uh, International Planned Parenthood Federation, IPPF, and uh, Reproductive Health Uganda that offers space uh, for young people to engage in the organizational governance, uh, in the organizational program designing, uh, and uh, project implementation. So after seeing the vital role of young people um, Reproductive Health Uganda and the IPPF chose this concept that young people are paramount uh, to engage in the activities that are being planned for them. So that's why Youth Action is in place. Um, so quite a number of things we do ranging from uh, um, SRHR advocacy, um, project designing, project uh, implementation, budget allocation and budget lobbying. YAM has been at the forefront of championing youth projects related to IPPF in their five thematic areas. Strengthening relationships for youth programming and empowerment with MasterCard Scholars Program at Bradvarkists, RH Youth hosted these scholars and gave them correct information on SRHR in order to make informed decisions. Reproductive Health Uganda organized a series of outreaches for young people through the youth office to equip students and community members with the knowledge and skills to make informed sexual reproductive health decisions. At Police Children's School, Bad Valley Primary School and Makere University, YAM also conducted a crossfire high school debate at Freedom City, Njeru Seventh-day Adventist Chapel Community Outreach and Bwaise Outreach where it promoted a world free of prostitution initiative. We held various radio talk shows at Galaxy FM in unison with CDFU. YAM has fronted a number of advocacy activities including policy formulation where communities were mobilized into a march advocating for the school healthy policy. We also gave information on menstrual cups while implementing menstrual cup Uganda activities. We have used social media influencing as a tool of advocacy. Youth participated in online activities supporting the various social media campaigns on tweet chats, Facebook live, YouTube YouTube streaming, WhatsApp discussions, and Instagram photo uploads with SRHR information. Young people participated in several capacity building, including CBO training and management, multiple skilling training, aimed at training volunteers in professional training, public speaking, and leadership skills. We also featured as facilitators in Inspire Girls Holiday Camp and held a branch executive committee induction at Fairway Hotel. Not forgetting, skills development at YMCA, training on utilizing social media as an essential tool for advocacy. It is in this same spirit that the State of Art Resource Center was refurbished, which will continue creating more space to house more youth-related capacity building activities for effective administrative work. The youth took lead in the production of the Youth Action Movement magazine, Issue 3, where activities of the youth were published. YAM held a number of elections, including the YAM Executive Committee elections in 2016 to the 2019. Akanyahayo Ambrose emerged as president, Nalukwako Judith, vice president, Namukuza Daphne Olga, general secretary, Kayinza Grace, fundraising secretary, Nakaziwe Dona, Katabira Mohamadi, and Oyo Victor committee members. After this then, the representatives were engaged in the YAM regional elections and Mukuza Daphin Olga emerged winner. RHU organized internship for young people through the youth office in fulfillment of the university requirement to acquire hands-on experience. We have noticed an increment in the number of youth who are applying for the RHU young people internship program supervised by Alex Craig Chiwanuka. YAM sent out a number of representatives to different forums both at national and at the international level. They included the IPPF African Regional Council meeting,
2016, IPBF African Regional Youth Forum, Nairobi, and the National Youth Council Public Debate in commemoration of International Youth Day in 2016 and the Grand SRHR Camp Festival in Kenya. The Youth Africa Day is an initiative by Yam Tororo Branch in partnership with Youth Effort with the aim of involving young people in activities they love to do such as music, dance and drama, fashion, etc. Creating a forum through which SRHR information can be shared in a safe environment without discrimination. In 2016, it was held at RHU Tororo offices. Youth Day Celebration. Yam has always celebrated the annual Youth Day and the different themes, for example, the Youth Building for Peace. Yam has always celebrated the annual Youth Day and the different themes such as Youth Building for Peace and others, presenting a unique opportunity for young people to make a statement on issues, approaches and challenges of social inclusion, capacity for the promotion and maintenance of peace and security. And they had a number of activities in including blood donation, nutrition services, HIV testing and counseling, cervical cancer screening, family planning services among the staffers, who are also honored by a visit from Dr. Alvaro Lamenjo at Catego Clinic, who is the Director General of International Planned Parenthood Federation. He also expressed the need to create more visibility for the things done at the youth center. We also installed Youth Notice Board as an info hub that shall run on a day-to-day -day basis with an aim of becoming a knowledge and information hub at the center. The Beauty Pageant, an annual event envisioned on beauty with zero discrimination, aimed at fighting stigma and discrimination against young people affected and living with HIV and AIDS. We are also honored to report that we received a special recognition of YAM Uganda members for their outstanding contribution to promoting access to youth-friendly sexual reproductive health services in the Karamoja region during the RHU celebration of 60 years of operation. We spearheaded the launch of the Young Dance Crew. This has been used as an edutainment platform to reach out to the young people with reproductive health information. Those and many more were the activities that were performed by the Young Executive Committee during the year 2016 to 2019. I'm proud to say that uh, as the chairperson of the Action Movement for the past three years, it has been a pleasure working with the Productive Health Uganda and working with IPPF. And so we encourage every single young person that is out there and wishes to join the organization. Space is there for you. You just come at uh, the Productive Health Uganda in Kamocha, Katego Road, and at a fee of only 5,000 shillings, you'll be in position to be part of uh, YAM. Uh, so, my last part message to you as a transition leadership to another governance is that um, young people are paramount in any designing or in any project that is being designed for them and until we engage them as duty bearers as of ngos that are looking towards working for young people projects will keep on dying and impact will never be realized and my last shots to the young people is that um, invest in uh, skilling yourself invest in uh, improving yourself building your skill best and that shall prepare you as you as you strive to keep keeping true to contributing to the communities you want to see and creating the desirable thank you so much